Hi guys, it's the Woodpeck here and welcome back to episode 32 of my Let's Play of the Minecraft mod pack, Life in the Woods Renaissance. Literally, just as I, just before when I was going to start recording, a creeper came up and completely destroyed the front of my farm. And now we've got just grass growing in here, which is a bit annoying. So we're, we're losing our plants. But yeah, in the previous episode, we had a few technical difficulties with fraps i.e. it crashed and it didn't tell me so yeah I, a lot of this was missing but this is kind of what i did i made a storage room and i've got stony stuff in here plus gunpowder flint and oh there's no gravel in there okay it's got a food chest which we're gonna need let's take out uh oh, we got some grapes i didn't i didn't notice that so what can you make grapes into okay grapes a mince pie fruit crumble seed of course <gasps> grape juice well, if we got, if we got, we got a juicer, haven't we? We got one. I've got one of them somewhere. Where's, where's our juicer at? What mustard? Do we not have a juicer? Is there any in this chest there? I'm sure we had a juicer, didn't we? Hang on, let's get that back up. And let's make see how we. Oh, what's this? Plate grape yogurt. Okay, a grape salad. <gasps> wow. Oh, it gives. Oh, it's still a light meal. Okay. Okay, there we go. So how do you make the juicer again? That's a, a, so a stone block and a pressure plate. Okay, that's not too difficult to do. We've got some stone on us in here. Let's get this. So we've got a gabbro. Now we just need to make a pressure plate. <laughs> Our pockets are still full up. So let's do that. There we go. No, 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 no. Pressure. Oh, you have, to, you have to smelt it, don't you? Oh, okay, um... What don't I need? Um, let's um, let's dump this stuff in our in our dump chest. The glass. Uh, get rid of the redstone, bricks, saddle. Uh, I'll keep the bee grub on me. Let's get rid of that. Just basically, just get rid of the stuff that I don't need right now, because yeah, we we our pockets are a little bit full, and Diane also is it coming night time already? Really? No, it isn't. Okay. So yeah, I am actually good to sleep. Whoops. Do I have my um? Yeah, I've got my 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 atlas on me. So I'm just gonna like literally go for a wander and see what we can find because I feel that you know that's kind of the whole one of the main points in this is to go for an adventure and I haven't really been doing that recently. Like I've spent a lot of time in, around my home, like expanding it and things, but I haven't really been oh. Oh, that is lucky. There's water down there. <laughs> Otherwise, that might that would have hurt quite a bit. Oh, look, that goes down quite deep, doesn't it? That's probably a cave down there. Yes, it is. Oh, whoa! <laughs> that got dark quite quickly. There is actually, I think, a cave down there. It, look, it looks like, or it might just be like a single block. It looks like a creeper's bee around here as well. Come on, there we go. So yeah, let's just keep going. Uh, what direction are we heading? We are heading uh, uh, this way. I like <laughs> west. It took me a while to f to l see where see where the um direction thing was. Then ah, we're back on the ocean, and I've just come across this tiny, tiny island. I can't see anything good on it. I'm just having a quick look over it, uh, but I can't see anything. So I'm just going to head over to this larger island, which is just forming in front of me. And I don't know if I've been. I might have been to some of these islands, so I can't be 100% sure. So I have to be very careful that I don't break these boats, because of course this is. Don't you love that? You get on the boat and you just like you're miles away from where from where the boat is. Anyway, here we are. We're at a different island. We've got some oak trees and some crickets. See, let's just have a look. I'm gonna knock down mm, some more trees simply so that I can um, use some more wood because I don't have much wood on me and I'm not sure if I've got any in my backpack or not. So let's just get a oh, look. It's a, it's a cool looking tree. It's not a standard tree. Let's get rid of all of this. I think we're gonna get six logs out of this. So, yep, six logs. There we go. Unless, oh no, there's more. Wow. Quite a big tree then. Feels like there might be another one down there somewhere. Oh, we've got a sapling. Nope, that's all of it. 
So we do we have some food? We've got uh, pineapples. I've got quite a bit of food in my backpack, I think. There we go. So let's have a look. Because we do need to get some more ancient trees as well. Let's just have a look around. Oh, some What's this? What is this? Oh, it's just grass. It looks completely different. And there's some some jungle trees. But I do like how this like these kind of look like that they're like young trees that haven't grown yet, don't they? I like that. That looks really cool. Yeah, they're just sort of the shrubs there. Ooh. All the time I'm oh sheep. Look at this, we found some sheep. Cool. I definitely I, I haven't seen a sheep in quite a while actually. So yeah, that's quite a rare thing that we found some sheep. Ow! Ooh. <gasps> We've found some baked beans. We have found some baked beans. Do we need baked beans for anything? Well, I've got I've got quite a bit of iron on me, so I'm going to collect some baked be some baked beans anyway. Because if only this was my base race, <laughs> I would just come across those that lava right there. Wouldn't that be just swell? There we go. Oh, look at that! It even works as like a light source. That is so cool. Let's just pick this back up using our chisel. Uh, oh, a little. I just saw some iron. Let's get that iron. Let's send out a free iron. Anything else down here? Of course, the lava bucket works two ways because you can also like put it down, and you'll be able to burn mobs. That's quite cool. So you can use it both as like a torch, and also get rid of the mobs. Let's, shall we mark this this cave down here? Let's mark this cave down. So let's let's add a marker there. Let's call it cave, not cafe. I've put cafe. Wow, um, cave two. I don't want to call it cafe. That's a bit of. A <laughs> I will just call my cave cafe. Wow. <laughs> there we go. Do I have some? I might make. Oh my goodness! We're we got um we got poison from something. What has poison dust? A spice bush. <gasps> so yeah, the spice bush is poisoning you, right? While it's still daytime, I'm just gonna quickly cut down these. Not cut down. I'm just gonna shear these sheep simply so that I can make a bed because I don't want to end up dying. There we go. That. That. Bed. There we go, let's just, can we please, there we go, let's head to sleep, right in the middle of the, in the middle of the forests, the real life in the woods experience, there we go, and it's such a beautiful morning, and the music has just started, I will leave that bed there as well, just so that, um, you know, if we die, it's still there, and we're going to spawn here and not spawn back wherever the world spawn is because that'll be a bit because that's quite a while quite a long way away from where my house is so yeah we wouldn't want to be doing that would we and we are getting poisoned all over the place but it doesn't seem to really do much so it's not so it's like a witch kind of poison see so, yeah, i think it's okay oh, what is this <gasps> quicksand i completely forgot about the quicksand oh my goodness i just completely forgot about that i just thought it was normal sand wow Excuse me, cow. Oh, sorry, cow. <laughs> a tulip biome. Yes. Yes. Oh, it won't be funny if I just come across the same thing I was like ages ago. Look at this, though. I just love this biome. Absolutely. Just look how simply stunning and beautiful that is. I, I, I love this pack. Just a flower field. Just look at these tulips. Oh my goodness, T tulips are one of my favourite flowers as well in real life. So, yeah, and these are, these are really accurate representations of tulips. They honestly are. Just look at them all. Oh my goodness, look at all of these tulips. Wow, they just go on and on. Oh my god, look at them all. Look at all of these tulips. Oh, I love them. I I'm hungry. 
They might not talk about tulips, I just noticed I am seriously hungry. I'm really bad food salad. Trouble is in this, this, I don't think there'll be any, like, gardens at all in this. So we won't be able to, like, pick up a, a quick snack. Because I don't think there's that many. Is there any food in my backpack? Let's have a look. Oh, we've got some iron. Uh, sapphire. Raspberry. Mustard, there we go. So we've got some mustard seeds. We've also got picked up a tulip as well, which is kind of cool. Let's have them then. I love getting mustard in my car already, so we can just do that. Get fish, there we go. That's better. Check out this cool cactus, which I just knocked down. Here's another one. It's called a a snow pole but I've never seen a cactus like that before it's kind of like really is desert colors isn't it it's like as if it truly belongs to be in this desert rather than being like green or something it looks kind of gnarled and desert like I like it I've pi <laughs> accidentally picked some up as well so we had to add them to our cactus collection which is now officially a real thing because I've already got a set of cacti so we can just this, look how cool that looks. I'm gonna have to make a boat on us and ride this. Yeah, let's let's do that. We're gonna have to do this. Let's make ourselves a boat, just just literally, so we can ride down that water. Because that just looks. Look at it. It's like a, a real flow. Look <gasps> oh! <gasps> that. It's actually a real waterfall. And you keep going down it. This is so much fun. Well, look at it. It just keeps going. This is so cool. This is so awesome. It is a real flowing river in Minecraft. It's actually flowing out to the sea through an estuary. I love it. I literally love it. It is so awesome. Look at that. Oh, there's some meanie beanie sharks down there. But how cool is this mod pack? Literally, how cool is this pack? Words can't even right now. Let's there we go. Let's get that. Let's get out of there because we don't want we don't want to be shark food. But isn't that just the most coolest thing you've ever seen? Ever, an actual real flowing river into the ocean in Minecraft. I just love it. I literally love it. That is just, it's awesome. Wow. Let's quick pick up our uh, crafting table. There we go. That is so cool. How awesome does this green schnist stone look like? It just looks so cool, doesn't it? Look at that. I'm gonna have to use this for my build. Look at it all. There's so much here as well. Let's get a whole stack of this because it just looks so cool. noticed as well there's a strange looking building that looks like it could be a building or at least it's made out of some very strange looking blocks whatever it is so let's go and quickly have a look at this what is this block what is this what is this dried dirt Ooh. but it looks I like it I like the look of it let's collect a couple of pieces if we can, can we not collect it do you need to use the pick oh there we go use the pickaxe Oh wow, it sort of break, it breaks like anything. There we go. Unlike dirt in real life, which um, in real life, like if you ever like dug into like dry soil, it's incredibly difficult to dig into. But look at this, it's kind of like, is this the, um? yeah, this is the wasteland biome. I thought it was, look at it. Look at it all, there's like nothing here. It's all dead. Ooh, looks so so sad, doesn't it? 
What a sad looking biome, look at it. You wouldn't be able to find anything, well there might be lucky stuff in here, I don't know, but it looks very, not very appetising. Not appetising, like, <laughs> not very um, amenable to live in. And, ooh, some different stuff down here. Comatai, what's this in the corner? Dire, right? I think because it's becoming night time, I'm just going to... Uh, oh, I need to make a bed. I'm just going to quickly make another bed, just so I can head to sleep. Because, yeah, we don't want to wake up with meanie beanies around. There we go. Also, I could, of course, now go back and destroy the, ba the bed that I made earlier, but... Uh, hello? There we go. But, of course, I don't really want to do that, because it's a long way away, and it'll take quite a while to get back. Yeah, this 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 um this biome though, especially when I'm running out of running out of food, it's not really. I suppose you know, because I set my spawn there, it doesn't really matter too much. And of course, I've got my um things. Let's add a marker for this as well. Let's add mark here. Let's call this. Uh, wish what? Well, let's just use that. Let's call this waste land. There we go. Because it's not a very nice area, really, is it? Random block of cobertite there. And we're back into the beach, which is a far more pleasant place. Which way should we head off now? We've got, we got enough wood on us, so let's just head out onto the ocean and see if we can get any... see if we can go anywhere cool. Also, as well, if you're in a boat, I don't... I'm not sure in this if you still use hunger or not, because I know usually it's kind of like a quick way to stop you from losing any hunger, but in this I don't know if it's been modded so that even when you're in a boat, if you still get hunger, I'm not sure, yeah. but it'd be so cool to explore the oceans as well, wouldn't it? Because I'm pretty sure, I mean there's sharks down there and various other fishies, um, like there's some rays down there, I'm sure there must be some cool stuff in there. And we're currently heading east. Okay, let's keep going east and see what we run into. Literally only about 15 or so seconds later, we've come across some land, so I could have easily have just kept recording there rather than stopping, but you never know, do you? When you... Oh, we did break the boat, okay. You never 100% know when you're looking for, for land how far away it will be, do you? Oh, but look at this. Some more... We have got some tropical blue bamboo. I will take some of that bamboo. I, lo I love the bamboo in this. Especially sort of like the more rarer ones. They're kind of like an alternative to trees, really. Because, think about it. Apart from the blocks, you can use it as like sticks. So it doesn't matter hugely. We're still starving that. <gasps> oh dear, should I... Um... Oh goodness, should I kill some cows to get some food? Um... I'm gonna have to. Sorry, I just I'm really hungry and I, I just need some food. There we go. Oh, it kind of that goes against what this mod pack's about. But if I didn't, I'd have died. So, and I'm right out here in the in the in the sticks, so to speak. And are these this bamboo growing through this? I thought the bamboo was growing through the tree. That'd be a bit bizarre, wouldn't it? Let's have a look. Is there any... Ooh. What is going on over there? Oh, it's just a tree. I was like, what is that? It's just it, from this distance. It, it renders in just like a square floating block. But it is actually a tree just with some vines down it. Can we make that? <sighs> yes, we did. Down there quickly. There might be piranhas. There might be, there might be piranhas. I don't think I've been killed by a piranha yet, which is which is quite quite lucky really, considering that well, they are in a lot of water. I'm holding down the sprint button even though I can't sprint, so yep. It's becoming night time, so I'm just gonna have to make a little hut and do a different kind of thing for a torch. Instead of putting a torch down, let's put some lava in here because it's safe in there and it gives us a different kind of light on things doesn't it very much a sort of red 
warm kind of light. Hopefully it won't escape. I don't think it should. But yeah. We, I do actually do have some food in my backpack. So let's just have a quick one. There we go. Anything more? Just going to try and get my f hunger right the way up. I'm not tired. Oh look, we got some peas in our backpack. We could have made I think it was shepherd's pie I was trying to make last time because we have actually got some peas. But yeah. I'm also going to swap my iron chest plate. And I don't have any wool on me, and I'm not sure if there's any sheep nearby. So let's have a quick look. Any, ch any sheep? Probably isn't. Can't see any sheep. No sheep. I should have sheared some more while I was while some around really, shouldn't I? Rather than just shearing like free wool. That wasn't really the most efficient use of wool, was it? But yeah, very much kind of exploring episode. But yeah, I do hope you enjoyed this video. Leave a like video, comment and subscribe. Follow me on Twitter at the Woodpack One. And I'll see you all later. Bye guys.